an extra day of travel. We need to fix the cart. See, 100, that's normal. Uh, pay. Damn. It's a lot of bad luck. Damn it. All right, on to trade. Uh, food is really cheap here. How about 21 for ore? For four units of ore? Nah. Well, not for total. This is per. 21 gold per unit of ore. No, but we will fill up on gold here. Seven gold per unit is pretty good. Yes, I know. Price fluctuations. Get out of here. Um, <clears throat> a lot of people feel that the price is random. I have found that there is a slight, slight advantage to visiting certain towns over other towns. Uh, like uh, Ugurun, U Ugurine, Ur Urgune, this one. <laughs> uh, this town specializes in ore. I found that their prices in ore usually are, are fairly reasonable and everywhere else it's terrible. Mm, I'm still working it out though. I'm, I've actually got a, a spreadsheet. Because that's what I do with trade games when I'm interested in them. Alright, on to Overos. Wait, wait, wait. I forgot. Anybody interesting here? No? Just a mer or a uh, mercenary? Alright, well. Back to Overos. 25 gold to get there. That'll be fine because we're about to make a lot of money. Uh, bridge toll, that's fine. You are attacked by a bunch of robbers. You can break your way through... I have not found there to be any kind of difference to saying yes or no. So we might as well say yes. Uh, we lose an ore. Well, it was free, so... Oh, well. That's cool. Uh, despite your efforts, the Roberts catch up and attack you. Caught up and attacked you. After a short fight, you were defeated by the robbers. Yay! And the robbers took some of your goods. We're going to steal this big rock! Okay. <laughs> Fine, whatever. Local diversity. Yes, that's, that's fine. That's fine. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, this exclamation point must have come up during uh, during an update because I don't remember that being there. Uh, so you come back for the chest. Be careful with it. It's important. All right. Uh, thanks a lot, Mind Flayer. Don't worry. I'll be careful. There we are. Ooh, you're pretty. I'm going to buy you around. Did you ever hear what the dwarves did when they were besieged by a horde of goblins? Well, I'll tell you, mate, because it's one of the things that show a lot about true grit. You're an elven giraffe. What do you know about true grit? And thank you. Let's get out of here. <laughs> um, all right. Let's see here. 40 per... Outfit. There we go. 40 per price for basically free money. Fuck yeah, that's 120 gold that we didn't have. Alright, uh, we paid 7. We're getting 10 per unit for the food we got. 240 gold, that's nice right there. But it's not as much as we're going to get from completing this quest, so we need to do that. Hides are ridiculously high here. I'm not going to do anything about this. Usually for uh, food, you want about 7 or 8. Uh, gold per unit. For hides, you want about eh, maybe 12 per unit. And for ore, you want about 36 per unit. Don't touch hill herbs. Don't touch oil. And I've never seen that ice was ever worth it. There's only a couple of places you can buy ice anyway. But in order to buy ice, check this out. In order to buy ice, you need to go to the armor, pick up one of these chests... Uh, and, as it says, an insulating chest lowers your capacity by 100 kilograms. That's 100 kilograms that you don't have to, to stock food or hides into. Early game, I, I, I just don't see it being worth it. Uh, let me see here. Check out the bar. We've already checked out the bar. Uh, beggar, come back when you have 4,000 trigons. Good luck trading. At least they're polite, you know? Mud the doorkeeper. Um, this is the guild, and when we get 4,000, we want to come back here and basically join the guild, because then we can start trading clothes and things. Alright. Oh, we can't pray at the shrine this time, because I did it too soon. Let me see. I wonder if it's faster 
to go north again, because this will probably take two days, and it'll pr probably take five days, I think, for getting through this forest to get back to uh, Urgene. Urgene. Hmm. I could just go back. Yeah, we're going to go back the way we came and uh, and check out that abandoned tower again. That was pretty nice. And uh, damn the mercenaries. One less mouth to feed. On we go. Travel cost 25 gold and 5 silver. I've seen the silver climb up to like 25 gold and 16 silver. And I'm like, how many silver makes a gold in this? Uh, I may never know. Bridge toll. That's fine. Uh, mercenary for the crew. You know what? Normally, sir, I would say no. I'd say go fuck yourself. But today I'm feeling good because I'm going to send you to your death. So yes, join in. Uh, let's see. Here's the log. Everything's cool. <clears throat> check out. See, I was going to hire one of these guys anyway, but one gold, eight silver. That's not bad. Let's check out the trade. Eight, eight for food isn't terrible. Nineteen for hide is. Hmm. Let's grab a little bit of food. I will grab fifteen, just half of what I can do. That's not too bad. Eight, eight for food isn't too bad. It's not great, but it's not too bad. Nine is a little worse. I don't know. I don't know. It's risk-reward. There's a lot of risk-reward thing. And like I said, this game is hard as far as trading goes. Especially in the beginning because, man... Ah, it's rough. Alright, two days to go there. Yes, we will. A huge bear wolf. A bear wolf? What is this? Uh, the last airbender? Uh, emerged from the forest. The beasts attack the cart. Your people engaged in combat and managed to defeat the beast. Hurrah! Unfortunately, some of your goods were damaged. Your day, your trip took one day longer than planned. Oh no, he had damaged my food. Eh. Eh, that's okay. Uh, that's never happened to me before. Uh, that's kind of cool. Alright, we're going to send two men in because that third guy is our cart runner. We don't want that, so... On to your death. Last time searched was 13 days ago. Come back and try again later. Oh, oh, I didn't know that. Well, eh, we'll, we'll get it next time. Search. Really? I did not know this. Okay, so you can only search so often and send men in so often. I wonder what the distance is between the two. Can, does that even show up in my log? Yes, it does. What's the name of this place again? The Abandoned Tower. So, what day were we at the, the Abandoned Tower? Uh, let's see. Here it goes. Uh, Urgene to the Ruins D. Ruins D? Developers, I, I think you may need to double check these kinds of things. If you like, I can start making a list. Anyway, but we were here on day 10. It's day 24. It's only been like 13, 14 days. That's what they were trying to say. All right, that's fine. Well, it was on the way to Urgene anyway. Bridge toll. That's cool. You come across a carriage of magnate. You come across a carriage of a magnate. Are they trying to say magnet? Who, in his rage, dismissed all his mercenaries. Afraid of bandits, he offers... To pay you for joining him in his... Oh, yes. Yes, sir, you can join me on my journey. I have two mercenaries. I will keep you very safe. This happens every now and then. Unfortunately, some of the food you were carrying has gone bad. To stop the spoiling, you had to throw out two food. That that happens. All right. The journey, seemed, uh, the journey goes smoothly and costs you nothing. The magnet is not even bothering you with talking. It seems that your, your stroke of... Ah, it seems that you stroke a good deal since he pays you this much money, which is always different, for next to nothing. Whenever a magnet ever offers to join your crew, you always say yes. I consider it good luck because it's free money, and he usually pays for the cost it takes just to get to wherever. Do you see that? 25 or 23 gold? That means I spent two gold in total. But this is why we're really here. Let's finish off this quest real quick. Great! You can imagine how helpful you were, or you can't imagine how helpful you were, either or. Here, take this for your trouble. He gives us 300. Yes! Great success. Alright, let me see here. I would take a loss if I sold the food here. So we'll probably head north to the port town. Ore is actually good. Do I have any room? I do. 
Let's take this ore. 31 per, per unit of ore is, is actually pretty nice. Herb sucks. Olive oil sucks. Everything sucks. Let's talk to the patron. Uh, who's interesting looking? Uh, you there. You look pretty nice. I'm going to buy you a small round. And the gurgling mass unleashed its tentacles upon us. Oh yes, we only survived thanks to my good old horse that was taken and eaten while we scrambled away. I can still remember its pulsating green body. The horse, not the monster. Full of skulls and bones. I'm gonna miss that horse. Damn. I'm going back to those runes as soon as I get a new horse. I miss its pulsating skull face. All right, that's nice. <laughs> Here's what I mean. People will sometimes pop, sometimes they'll just pop in and pop out of place. Um, how long have I been recording? You know, I'm going to break the recording here. Don't know if I'll continue. I'll probably continue. Fuck it. I'm having fun. Okay, I'm back. Just put a little break in the recording and uh, I don't even know how I'm going to do this. Uh, I'll probably put a stupid little opening and draw a stupid picture of me driving a wagon and uh, I don't know. But I'll tell you what I do know. I'm I'm re relaxing, you know. I'm coming down from my anger high earlier today and uh, I really like this game. It's it's relaxing. Hmm. Okay, what do you have to buy here? Oh, what is this? This minuscule vial contains the essence of Umka Seal's reproduction glands. Umka Seal's reproduction glands. Oh, I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to have two plurals. It should be Umka Seal, or there should be an apostrophe here, reproduction glands. <clears throat> you need to get a proofreader, man. You just need to get a proofreader. It's okay. I know you're, what, probably Russian? I think this is a Russian developer. But uh, it's okay. They're they're cheap. They go by the hour. And uh, you you don't even have to have them play the game. You can just send the text to them and they'll, they'll take care of it for you, all right? All right. Well, I'm worried about you. It's a perfume, aphrodisiac, that only, that there needs to be a comma here, that only the most rich ladies could afford. Umka seals are scarce and very hard to catch. Hmm. Gross. I want some. What is that? What is... That reminds me. No, no, no. Stop everything. Stop everything. Identify. We have this thing. Ident unidentified item. To find out what it is, identify it in the cantor. Uh, always identify. Chances are good it's always going to be more expensive than the cost to identify it. Uh, a good bottle of wine is worth a fortune. The older, the better. Ooh, I don't even know if I want to get rid of it. How much would I get for it? 400? Nice! 400? 400? Should I stay? I mean, should it? Hmm. No. We're not going to sell it here. I want to go up north. What is it now? It's 4, th four, four 500. Five, 48. 48 tens. That's, that four... Ah, that's terrible. All right. No, that, that's good. That's a lot of money. We're going to use that. We're going to go up north. Now, I also have some diamonds here, and I never use diamonds. So we're going to sell both of our diamonds for 50 gold each. And uh, can I... Nope. Can't go to the blind god yet. Do I need anything repaired? No, I don't. This is what I do. I just click through. Mainly, I go through trade, the bar, and the blind god shrine. I rarely go to this place, but occasionally I, f I find something interesting. I want to see if the... Uh, okay, that was 480 gold for that wine. I want to see if I can get a better price for it up north, which is where we're going next. To uh, Osmore. Osmore. Yes, that is the Latin pronunciation. pronunciation. And that's four days and 26 gold. That should be good considering the amount that we're carrying with us. So let's go. Uh, during your stop, you met another trader who offers a game of craps. No. No. Just no. It's not worth gam... You're a merchant, not a gambler. All right? No. 
The trader shrugs and complains about young people's manners. <laughs> Maybe he heard me. <laughs> uh, no crew died. Excellent. Hey, we have a quest. Okay, this is new. Like, this is brand new. Like, today new. I, I, I like that. I like that there are quests here. So, um, what do you got for us? Hey, friend, wait a moment. Are you leaving town? That's marvelous. I need you to do me a little favor. I have a gift for my dear friend, Yorau. Yorau. Yao. Yorau. Yor, the Y Man. The Y Man is in Siltara these days. Siltara, I believe that's south. Please take this gift to him, and he shall give one for me in return. Just bring it to me, and I'll reward you handsomely with gold. What do you think about that? Package delivery? Why not? I'm on the road anyways. Always take quests, especially in the beginning. So there we go. Awesome. Now, this bottle of wine. Same amount. Hmm. I don't know if it actually gets better with age. I don't know if the cost of the wine will go up as I keep it. I'm going to keep it until I need it. If, if I need, like, only... <clears throat> about 500 to break the 4,000 mark in order to get in with the guild, I'll sell it. But otherwise, we're going to keep it for now. I don't really see any benefit in getting rid of it just now. All right. Trade. Ooh. Nice in the food. Let's go ahead and sell that. What about ore? 34? Mm. I can get better. I'm going to leave that there. Oh, uh, while I'm here, hides suck. Olive oil always sucks. Hill herbs. Why are there hill herbs being sold illegally in the port town? Oh, because it's a port town. Now, we could use this to sail across the ocean. Fuck that. I have never found it to be good just yet. But, uh, again, I've only played the game for one game year in town. Uh, let's check out the pub. Ooh. You look awesome. Goblins are only good when deep fried. What? <laughs> in any other form, they try to run away and bring more friends. So if you're going in goblin country, remember to bring some fire spells with our... Always. Found, found another typo. Found another typo right here. Ladies and gentlemen. Typo. It makes your game look unprofessional, man. And it doesn't cost that much in the long in the long run. Just write all your text down, send it to a proofreader. It's not that expensive. You can get people in India to do it for you. And yes, these are people who know English well enough to proofread your manuscript, all right? It's okay, and it's super cheap. I don't care that it's outsourcing. You're, you live in... I don't know, Slovakia, where, wherever you guys are, I, I love your game, proofread your stuff. All right, Magical Academy, okay, I usually check this place by, by habit to see if it has a quest, they don't right now. So let's see, where did this guy want me to go? He needs me to check out the Y-Man in Siltara. Where is Siltara? I believe it's south, isn't it? Okay, this is the Empire. I'll get to the Empire later. Uh, basically, there are three factions. The Empire, which is on the uh, east side. On the west side, there are two towns for barbarians. Only two uh, in the mountains. And um, there's actually a, play a way that you can get a really good deal from all barbarians, and it'll make you hang around this. Everybody else in the middle is neutral, which is where your territory is. Siltara, Siltara. I usually hang around like the northern part, so I know it's not there. Gato, Rachi. Ah, here's Siltara. Wow, you're far south. No shit. Hmm. Is there a time limit? 100 days to do this. 100 days is almost a uh, season and a half, so we got time. Okay. Airship! So cool, so cool. I'd like to own my own. That would probably make it worth it. If I could own my own ship and own my own airship, that would probably make traveling across to the islands worth it. Hmm. How much does it cost? 
34 gold travel. And then you'd have to actually travel to these places. Can I only travel to that, those? Can I travel anywhere else? No. I can only travel to one spot. How am I supposed to do trade with these islands? Hmm. Hmm. All right. <clears throat> Let's see here. Doing a quick uh, upgrade. I got some ore with me. I'm holding out. Let's head south. Let's head to this town. Rasuvio. It's a nice, nice name. Nice name. Onwards. During your stop, you meet another trader who offered to play a game of craps? No. And... Food is expensive. Hides aren't terrible. I wish we could do better. Ore? No, no, no. They do not need ore right now. So we're going to keep the ore with us. This happens a lot. Never be afraid to pass on a town. Never be afraid to not do business. Uh, anybody in the pub worth talking to? Whoa, you're neat looking. You're a merchant. Why would I want another merchant? I'm a merchant. I don't need you. Get out of here. Wait, wait, wait. Buy you around. So this is it. No more will we roam these lands, mate. No more. The barons are introducing a road tax. How do you expect one to make a living with that? If they'd fix the roads at least, but no. No, oh, thanks for the information about the roads. You're awesome. Let's go to uh, Tunigan. I believe that's Tunigan. I'm going by Latin pronunciations again. Uh, four days, 36 gold. That's um, starting to get... Ah, oh, god damn it. Another bear wolf attack. Moving on. Bridge tall, that's fine. Uh, okay. In accordance with the governor's orders, you will pay trading tax. 20 trigons for each cart. That's 20 trigons. Now, I could bribe him for 40, 280... This is fine, except it's not guaranteed to work, and it's more than 20 triguns. Do nothing. I'll pay the money. That's fine. All right. Trade. Hi, I have some ore. 34 per. God, I feel like I can do better than that. I just feel like I can do better than that, so I'm not going to do it again. Uh, hide suck. Food sucks. We're done here. Let's see, what do you have? I want this. Ooh, it's cheap. Usually they go for like 150. For 86 gold for a five leaf clover? I'll do that. I don't know what it's good for, but uh, oh, there it is. I like them. I like I like anything that makes me more lucky. It, it, it made me maybe slightly more lucky. I don't know. I'm not sure why that happened. Uh, anybody in the pub? This guy. What a beard. But I'm going to skip him. Let's move on. Go to Nebero again, because we're on our way to uh, uh, Siltara. Now, when it says you have 100 days to complete the quest, it means that leg of the quest. Because, uh, let's move up to the quest real quick. It says, like, one out of six. One out of six? What the fuck? But anyway, it's just saying that nine, you have 92 days to get this leg of the journey done. Once we talk to the guy, it'll be two out of six. And then he'll probably have to go to... I don't know, wherever the first guy is, and it'll be three out of six, and so on. And But uh, it'll reset the timer each time. Let's head to Nabarro. Uh, a bunch of robbers you can try to break through. Want to try? Yes. I lost an ore. Damn it. They also... Shit. They found some of my money. God damn. Not good luck. All right. Uh, trade. Do you need ore? Fuck, you don't need ore. And nothing is good for sale here. This is why the, I told you the game is fucking brutal. Anybody in the pub we're talking to? No. I have two mercenaries and a driver. Why aren't you guys earning your fucking keep and keeping me safe and my money, damn it, onto over us? Bridge toll, that's fine. All right, how about you? Do you guys need ore? Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to ditch the ore. I'm tired of carting it around. Uh, food and hides are way expensive here. So is olive oil, as always. 
Uh, nothing else is worth our time here. Let's give 100 to the blind god. Remain silent. I guess it's better than nothing. Sometimes it's good news. All right. Sometimes I do it because sometimes, sometimes it gives me a luck upgrade, and I'm honestly all about the luck in this game. What are you? I've never seen you. Massaging parlor. What? Not bought. Purchase from town hall. Okay, I could possibly purchase the massage parlor. Is this a whorehouse? <laughs> Guys, I think this is a brothel. <laughs> I have found a life goal. I want to be a motherfucking pimp for Overos. Yes. Yes. Y-E-S. Do it.